morning, and welcome to Morning Manna. Today is Monday, April the 11th, 2022, and this is episode 3,774. My name is Bruce Turner. Welcome to today's Morning Manna. Today's episode, Humbled and Exalted. Stay tuned. So this is Passion Week, the week of passion, the week that we celebrate the death of Jesus Christ on Good Friday and his resurrection on Sunday. It's Passion Week. We're about to celebrate Easter, a most incredible experience. And I want to begin this week by sharing with you a passage of scripture from Philippians chapter 2. It's verses 5 through 11. And I want to help you and to help myself to begin this week to focus on the incredible sacrifice, the incredible expression of love that God had and has for us. Let this mind be in you, which was also in Christ Jesus. Now that's a challenge, right? (laughs) That's a challenge for us today to let this mind, the mind of Christ, be in us today, to think like he thought. Who, being in the form of God, did not consider it robbery to be equal with God, but made himself of no reputation. Are you thinking like Jesus right now? He made himself of no reputation, taking the form of a bondservant and coming in the likeness of men. And being found in appearance as a man, he humbled himself. Are you thinking like Jesus? And became obedient to the point of death, even the death of the cross. Let this mind be in you, which was also in in Christ Jesus. He made himself of no reputation. He took upon himself the form of a bondservant. He humbled himself and became obedient to the point of death, humbled. But then verse 9, Therefore, God also has highly exalted him and given him the name which is above every name, that at the name of Jesus every knee should bow, of those in heaven and those on earth and of those under the earth and that every tongue should confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Humbled and exalted. Humbled and exalted. That's God's way. Now there are many things in the Bible that I'll probably never comprehend this side of heaven, but this has to be one of the biggest. That God in the person of Jesus would come to earth as a human, live as one of the humblest of humans, then allow himself to be cruelly condemned and crucified. It's way beyond me. Not only did God do this, but he did it out of love. Not only did he do it out of love, but he did it out of love for everyone who sins against him. Think about that. As difficult as it is for me to fathom such a thing, what's even more incomprehensible is that so many turn their backs on this greatest act of love creation has ever or will ever see. 
Listen, if you've not accepted Jesus Christ as your personal Lord and Savior, believing in your heart that he died for your sins, was buried and rose again, accept him today. Accept him today. Father, thank you for the humble and exalted Christ. Let that mind be in us today. In Jesus' name, amen. Have a great Monday. Till tomorrow morning, this is Bruce reminding you to choose joy.